Hello, everybody. Oh, let me move that closer. Uh, there we go. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Birds Eye Plays Odin Sphere. Uh, boss. That's right. Yes. Because we were going to finish the Puka Print stuff. <gasps> My I'm wife. sure you've realized by now that escape is impossible. Now give me back that ring. Never. I promised to protect it. I cannot let anyone have oh. it. I just realized I'm turned all the way this up. This ring, it controls Weird. the cauldron. I must stop the cauldron. He is nearby right now. Who are you talking about? The cauldron's controller. The ring's owner, Valentine. He cannot control it again. It will repeat a tragedy. You are making excuses in order to keep the ring to yourself. This is what you get. Ah! Ah. Princess Velvet! Puka, I beg of you. Please, get the ring. The ring? This one? Protect it. Give it to no one. Listen. Give me my ring. This weapon is a magic bow. It only takes one shot. You and heard this the is princess. a magic sword. You're acting like a child. I'll let it slide. Go away. Don't take me for a fool. I don't fear you, Puka. I won't forgive you. You should. Fear me, I mean. I don't care if you forgive me or not. I'll still kill you. Oh, there we go. Sorry, I'm trying to remember the That are still hitting her. She's unconscious. Princess Velvet, are you all right? I see. My granddaughter yet lives. Oh, it was him. Puka, do not come this way. Take the ring and escape. No, that spirit I helped. I must thank you. I managed to escape back to this world without being caught by that pale woman. That crown? So you must be... I am the King of Valentine! The cauldron is my heart. And the titril, my throne. Ah. The ring has been returned to its rightful owner. Grandfather, please think about this. You and your brother escaped the curse. You can't comprehend what it's like. This pain and suffering. Neither can Odin, nor the fairies, nor all of Titania. They must see hell firsthand. You want the world to end? Take a good look at me. All I want is oblivion. Yes, the world's demise. 
Just like the prophecies, the lid to hell opens. <laughs> the time has now come. It seems that all the rational thinking fell out of that bony skull of yours. Damn, Puka. Do you think waving some magic sword from Titania around makes you a hero? Watch your mouth. Kneel, fool! I am your king! You were never my king! Shrink. Ah! You fool! Intruding on us? This isn't over! You hear?! Just walks away slowly. Princess! Oh. I also forgot to mention, um... I, I've noticed this a couple times. I don't know Thank what's going you. on. I'm trying to fix it, but... Thank you, every so Puka. often it seems the audio goes out of sync. Princess um, Velvet. and I apologize for that. I wanted to see you. Tis me, Cornelius. No, I um, can't. She can't love me when I'm I'm like unsure of this. what's... what's happening. I can't tell her. Just close your mouth and endure the pain. But for how long? Forever. Oh, here you are. Hi. You jumped out of bed the instant you woke up. How do you feel? I think you should get more rest. The princess, how is she? Princess Velvet brought you back here. Where is she? She's not here right now. She was in a hurry to leave. Sadness. Don't care. All right, what'd we get? Stun um, Oh, sure. It's a passive skill, so. I'm gonna let them talk. I'm gonna shut my window. I'm freezing. Damn it. Hang on. Um, um. Welcome! Real good. That's a lot of XP. And nothing has a bonus, so. Moving a little too fast. Something. Um, 
that for sure. Close enough. Yeah. Okay, now while they talk, I'm going to close the window. Much better now. I gotta cut those ears off. <gasps> <laughs> no, tis better to skin them and make a nice fur cloak. Ah! Hey Stop! This is Puka territory. Get out, goblins. What are you saying? This is our land. We're citizens of Valentine. We're entitled to this land. Stop talking nonsense. No, it's true. Pukas with evil hearts are turned into goblins. Ah. But I don't know why they would act this way. The coins must be given freely in order for the spell to be broken. Stealing the coins won't help. We know that. After all, our king cursed us. But King Valentine ordered us to do this. King Valentine. Oh, fucker. This isn't our idea. But we can't just let you pukas be the only ones who get to be humans again. Mm. What if we toss the coins in the lava in the Fire Kingdom like the king said? It'll glorify your crying faces forever. Wait! Meryl, are you all right? Oh, no. You can't let them... If we lose the coins, then we will never return to our old selves. So I feel like it's definitely better if I focus on pouring my the Fozons into, into my abilities instead of leveling instead of feeding myself because I'm I think I'm the same level as <coughs> I think I'm the exact same level as Gwendolyn right now. Probably. We'll find out.
Okay, wait, so how... Oh, I see. stronger because I used to struggle against these guys as Glenn. But now I can finish them off with just one combo. How do I get up there? Or is there just a much longer way to do that? Might as well. Oh! <laughs> 
Should have registered that checkpoint first. That's okay. Okay, you first. Struggling a little bit to see. I feel better.
Eh, might as well. See if you got anything to cook, and then I'll end the episode here. Morris, this is up now. Then. Hmm. As you wish. Ow. Is there anything else? You Another one. Well, that's where I'm going to end that, so thank you guys so much for watching. Next time at Bird's Eye, we will go ahead and, uh, well, we'll finish this chapter and then I think move on to the epilogue, if I remember right. So I'll see you guys next time.